Morning, everyone. I'm Scott Micklin. It is Wednesday, June 3rd. Good morning from KSJE, the community-supported radio station here at San Juan College. And here's what you'll be seeing this morning when you join me a little bit after 8 o'clock. My guest today on the program, District Attorney Rick Tedrow, is going to be joining me here in Studio A. We'll be talking about uh, law enforcement, prosecution of crimes during this pandemic, and much, much more. That's all coming up this morning at 8, 10 a.m. You can listen, of course, at 90.9 FM, 103.3 FM, or watch the visual radio program broadcasting live to the KSJE YouTube channel and to our Facebook page. DA Rick Tedro coming up today at 8.10 a.m. At 8.50 a.m. this morning, we'll take a trip to the Encouragement Lab. Dr. Mike Hannibaugh is going to be joining me from the lab today. His theme and message this week is to listen to the shy voices. He'll explain what that's all about coming up today at 8.50 a.m. on KSJE. 9 a.m. on our Facebook page and YouTube channel. It's our live COVID-19 local information program. Megan Cullop will be joining me here. We'll get an update on testing from the Department of Health. Also an update about efforts at San Juan County from Devin Neely. That is planned today at 9 a.m. A rebroadcast, of course, on the radio at 5.06 p.m. over the airwaves on KSJE. On the airwaves at 9 a.m. from McCass, of course, it's Roving with the Arts today. Mick, of course, has his 90-minute program on Wednesday, so he is playing all of Mahler's great Sixth Symphony. You'll hear that today at 9.06 on Roving with the Arts on KSJE. That takes us to 10.30, our local and regional author program, right on Four Corners. Tracy Helsvass is speaking with author E.J. Randolph about her book, which is called The Ambassador Calls Twice. You'll hear that interview coming up today at 10.30 on KSJE. Don't forget, of course, we're also on Twitter and Instagram if you're a social media person. And our weather forecast, partly sunny skies today with a high of 92 in Farmington, clear and 56 overnight. Mostly sunny skies on Thursday with a high of 93. Then maybe another chance of a scattered shower or thunderstorm in the forecast for both Friday and Saturday. 95 for a high on Friday, but much cooler weather on Saturday by 10 degrees. The high only reaching 85 degrees on Saturday. Big four more sunshine comes into the forecast beginning on Sunday. I'm Scott Micklin. Thanks so much for joining me this morning, everyone. Have a great Wednesday. I'll see you right here on the radio.